this is Frera and Macy. We're here to talk today about fractions. I, last time Winnie was in the video, so I thought today Macy could be in the video. So, we're going to talk about fractions. That's one out of two of my cats. So this is one half of the cats in my house. So, <clears throat> we've talked a little bit about fractions before, and this, so for some of you this is going to be a bit of a review. Fractions are when you take something and you split it into parts. And the two big vocabulary words that I want you to think about today are parts, which means how many pieces there are, and the whole, which is right here, for example, I have a whole orange, okay? So if I peel this orange, this whole orange, It is one whole orange. It's actually a clementine, but we'll just call it an orange. Okay, if I break this into two equal parts, this is one piece out of two, or we say that one half. The way we write one half looks like this. We write one, then we draw a line, and then we draw two underneath. The one is how many pieces we're talking about, one piece. The bottom number, the two, is how many <clears throat> pieces there are together that make the whole. So for this example, there's two pieces that make the whole. And I just say one of them. So I ate one half of the clementine. Okay? So down here I have pictures of rectangles, and we're going to talk about different fractional parts of these. The whole entire rectangle here is one whole. But I've broken this one into one, two, three, four pieces. So the bottom number of my fraction will be four. And if I shade it in, hmm, I'll shade in that piece, and I'll shade in that piece, how many pieces did I shade in? One, two. So I've shaded in two, out of one, two, three, four pieces all together. So the fraction for this picture is two fourths. Okay, we say that two fourths. Mrs. Ferris talked about that before in class. Because when we say <clears throat> the fraction, the bottom number, you don't say two four, you say two fourths because you broke it into four pieces. So for example, going back to my orange, okay. If I break it into four even pieces, one, two, three, four, the bottom number will be four, just like here. And if I ate one of them, I ate one piece of orange out of four pieces altogether. We say that one fourth of the, or of the clementine I just ate. If we look at this rectangle here, we can see that it's split into one, two, three equal pieces. And that's the trick about fractions, is you wanna to try to get the pieces to be as close to even as possible. We've talked about things being fair and not fair. For fractions, we always wanna make sure things are fair. So we have one, two, three pieces. So my bottom number, how many pieces there are, will be three. If I, if this was a cake, and I ate, wow, that's a lot of cake, Mrs. Ferry. And I ate one piece, I ate one third of the cake. I was really hungry. That's a big cake for Mrs. Ferry to eat one third. But, <clears throat> then down here, hmm, how many pieces is that split into? One, two. This rectangle has two pieces. And, oh, I'm so full from eating the orange and eating the cake. I'm not gonna eat any of this. So I'm gonna, if I eat nothing, what number is nothing? The same as nothing. Do you remember what Mrs. Ferris said? Zero. So that's zero halves. I eat zero halves of the cake. But then later, after I watch a movie, I might get a little hungry after that. And I'm like, you know what? Now I kind of feel like eating that. So I'm gonna eat one piece. So I'm gonna eat one 
half of the cake. One piece I ate out of two pieces there were all together. So that's one half. We're going to be talking about fractions a lot this week. And you're going to see videos from, by Mrs. Herrera about fractions. We're going to talk about this fraction bars, which right here we have one whole. Then we have halves, thirds, fourths. We're going to talk about the rest of this later on this week. I'm looking forward to talking to you more about fractions. I miss you guys a lot. Happy Monday. I hope you're doing great. And if you need anything from Mrs. Ferreira, make sure you Zoom me today in between the hours of 10.30 and 11.30. Just click on the Zoom link below. Hope you're well. Miss you guys a lot. Bye-bye.